fucking Rockaway. Fucking Rockaway. Yeah, fair, fairly. Whoa. <laughs> you okay? <laughs> Yeah, I'm ready to go. I don't know, like, I actually don't know these things. Okay. What we're doing yeah. is reviewing the board that you shaped. Okay. So, so I don't know, I know the length and that is it. And, and lobster is one of my favorite dishes ever. And I was like thinking about what I was gonna do and I saw a photo of a lobster claw. Yeah. And I like, I was like, whoa, that could be a cool tail. The right side is probably a quarter inch thicker than the left. Both sides are completely different. Honestly. <laughs> In good waves, I think it would work well. Yeah. Oh. It's more like right here or something? Yeah, maybe just lay it down. It's a little windy, I just don't want it to blow over on you. Uh, it'll be fine. You think it's gonna be okay? Yeah, if it falls, it'll be funny. Okay. <laughs> it'll, be it'll be cinematic. Yeah. But I'm not sure about the volume. No, I pretty much make the same, or I try to make the same board every time. Yeah. No sweat, man. Cool. Where should I put this? I'm gonna do a 5.5. Five. 20 and a quarter, 2 and 3 eighths. What's the volume? 11. 11. I played around with a lot, and for a while I was doing like a weird huh, double concave between the fins, but lately I've just been doing more simple, like flat, and then just V off the tail. 23 and a half and two and seven eighths. 23 and a half, two and seven eighths. Like, I live in Hawaii, right? The North Shore. I got more barrels during that hurricane than I've serious? ever got in Hawaii, like back to back to back. Yeah, that's a Dane Peterson oh. shape. It's my second time riding it, so yeah, I'm yeah. getting used to it. Yeah, sexy. <laughs> Love it. Yeah, I got so lucky with this board. It's been years that I've wanted one of his boards. I, I really want to get one at some point. Yeah. I got it's getting windy. It is. Kind of typical log, it's 10-1. Moderate volume. No, this is something new. In the past, I've been riding like really beefy down nose boards where the nose kind of has like a beak to it. it. Everything's a learning experience when it comes to shaping a new board. You always learn something you didn't know before, so. Yeah. You, have you shaped a bunch of boards, Andrew? No, nah, this is my first one. That's your first one. Who gave you a hand? Uh, Max Dexter. Um, I don't know, because it looked pretty fun. I kind of just wanted something that was kind of short, wide, skatey, skatey vibe. At last minute I came up with putting this little mini bat tail on there. Yeah, it says Batman. Just because, you know, we're in New York. And this is where Batman's from. <laughs> Woo! Can you, you hold that, do babe? Together? Do you want to just do it together? I want to ride on the blackboard. Okay. Shaper. Oh, you go. <laughs> that's terrible. <laughs> oh, that's a 9.5. It's right and right there. This is the board. <laughs> the, the yellow one that you just made is like pretty cool because you hold the nose so well compared to every other I have, so I just love it and it's like easy to turn, but it's like being in an elevator, it doesn't fit. <laughs> <laughs> My shaper's an asshole. How do you spell leaders? Uh, yeah, for the most part, most of like all the long boards I make it for nice. myself. Oh, it's like a workout. <laughs> just a little bit of concave. It's like belly throughout the tail. It's kind of just like a long hole. With a long, hole. long hole with concave. Oh, there's a whole thing. But I don't know this stuff. <laughs> don't tell me you forgot how to spell Matt's last name. I was just gonna write Matt Bing. Awesome. This is going really well. Yeah, I don't know. We're trying to make like an East Coast log and working with Matt at Bing and goes really good on the points. Like nice heavy kind of all around loggy. Loggy log. It's a loggy log. I saw you get a good one through the net earlier. I did you get a, a pretty good a, one, good didn't I? Nice. This guy. <laughs> Wet enough? Because I, I have no idea. That's and okay. then, boom. Sick. There you go. Yeah. And then I hit some crazy Growth spurt 
and kicked it right into this, I realized, oh my God, this works good. And just bada bing, bada boom. Sick. Lots of nose rides and lots, lots of, of turns. <laughs> Just in case it's going really bad. 365, baby. Yeah, exactly. Nice. It works, right? Yeah. <laughs> Just a big sidewalk, kind of thick and wide, and tail block pretty good. More wax on the bottom, because got to have the wax on the bottom. And then, yeah, just 9 8, little sidewalk, walks on water. But yeah, I started my own label with Ricky Carroll called Black Rose Manufacturing, yeah. which is the rose right there. It's more of like a piggy kind of nose rider. Yeah. <laughs> Standard boards that you ride? But yeah, pretty much. It's like I'm, I use three different shapers, okay. and I use three different sizes basically from all of them. Uh, so. My board is, um, it's 9.6, actually 9.6 and a half to be exact. Kind of all the time, that's the only board I ride. Yeah, that board is my magic board. <laughs> Loud is a very good answer for that. I don't know, I've just been like kind of bored of riding longboards every day. I've been seeing Alex at Sano a lot riding a mid-length and it's been fun to like talk to him about boards and shaping and he offered to help me which is really rad and I think it came out pretty fun. I think it's for a bigger guy though, because it's pretty thick. It came out like thicker than I anticipated. I need to switch a card really quick. <laughs> I just need a couple. Okay, that's enough. Okay, I